a lot of thank you. and what i do <laughs> hello everybody it's a pcos or pcod diet video today this is also the diet that i'm following at the moment post keto diet to maintain my weight or to put on lean muscles as well so if you want to know what i eat in a day then please continue watching so as soon as i wake up i don't do any of that hot water lemon honey thing i mean i feel like it's totally unnecessary going off of sugar and simple carbohydrates that breaks down easy was the best way to lose weight on PCOS so that's why I never have anything that is remotely sugary so like every single Indian I'm gonna start my day with some poha and in this case I'm having some ragi poha ragi is called finger millet and it is very indigenous to South India and it is a slow releasing carbohydrate so to start off with I am going to temper a little bit of oil, mustard seeds, cumin seeds, peanuts and fry until the peanuts are golden. Then I am going to add in some green chilies, some onion, salt and turmeric and stir until the onions are slightly translucent. Then I am going to add these uh, ragi flakes which I got from Big Basket and a stir to mix then I'm also going to sprinkle in some water so the ragi has some moisture to cook in I'm gonna add as much water as the ragi is going to require then I'm going to stir everything and uh, yeah that's it that's my breakfast ready I'm gonna have one cup of this and I'm gonna share the rest with Vicky Post breakfast, uh, generally around 11, 11.30ish, I feel a little bit peckish. So what I do is I roast some peanuts and I snack on them. Mm, yummy. Roasted peanuts are the best. Peanuts have some really healthy fat that your body needs to counter cholesterol and it also has a lot of protein. So I munch on them. And of course you can have as many cups of black coffee as you want or green tea as you want. Of course I have it without any kind of sugar or milk. So like every South Indian I love rice as well. I love having a wholesome rice lunch. Instead of rice I've substituted with foxtail millet. So to start off with I am going to make some uh, uh, green gram uh, sabzi with a little bit of green vegetables as well and as you can see I've started with a small tempering of oil, mustard seeds, cumin seeds, green chili and uh, onions. I've also added in some salt and turmeric and cooked until everything is kind of golden. To this I'm adding a mixture of pressure cooked green gram and some green leafy vegetables because they are very high in proteins and they are low in calories as well and they fill you up very fast and also green grams and green leafy vegetables they are very high in fiber which will again help in weight loss and to cook the foxtail millet I am going to add one cup of foxtail millet to two cups of water and pressure cook for about three visuals and uh, once it's all fluffy I'm just going to serve it into my plate and for my salad because I'm feeling a little bit lazy I've just sliced up some cucumber and uh, I'm also having my millet with rasam because I love Tamil style tomato rasam. In the evening again when you feel a little bit peckish for me this happens generally around 6 o'clock as soon as I come home so what I do is I have a little bit of a fruit now summer is a fantastic time for fruits you guys can have all the melons that you want and uh, of course you can have apples and uh, the only fruit I would recommend you not have especially during weight loss are mangoes and bananas apart from these two I think you're good to have anything that you want now a dinner is a very simple affair as well I am going to have two rotis with some dal and uh, to make this dal I'm going to add in some uh, garlic onion and tomato into a pan and into the same pan as well I'm going to add some split uh, green gram and these ones have 
their skin on so that is extra fiber that is extra nutrient as well and this liquid that i'm adding is the stock that i got from pressure cooking the green grams and the greens from lunch and once the dal is kind of partially cooked i'm going to season it with salt red chili powder coriander powder and a small little bit of garam masala and stir everything together i'm also going to cover this and continue to cook it further for 10 minutes until everything is completely cooked through now finally i'm going to sprinkle in some kasuri methi because i love the flavor of it and just let this settle for 10 minutes Now while this is happening I'm going to grate in some carrots and cube some cucumber into fine little pieces I'm just going to add it into a bowl sprinkle in some salt and pepper and mix and that's my salad for my dinner Now I love having salad with every single meal because that is a lot of raw vegetable filling my stomach up and uh, that is that much less carbs that I have to eat So to serve my dinner I'm going to have two rotis with uh, about 3 heaped tablespoon of the salad a cup of the cooked dal and uh, and this is totally optional if your doctor asks you not to have yogurt you don't have to but mine never did so I'm going to have two tablespoons of natural yogurt I would uh, recommend you have at least 5 to 6 liters of water I know that's a lot of water but please try and have as much water as you can because that really helps with your weight loss process and uh, yeah that's it for this video thank you so much for watching if you liked it don't forget to hit the thumbs up button don't forget to share this with anybody you know might find it helpful and uh, yeah comment down below and let me know what you think i will see you in my next one love you so much bye